says Mid Game Friends What about the channel? And in today's video we are going to review a surprise Disney movie and you guys will be surprised about it about this and that is The Hunchback of Notre Dame That's right guys the nineteen ninety six movie Yeah it's in there this is the movie and before we do if you want to subscribe it and watch for me, please do me for the setup. You should subscribe to the channel, smash the button, turn it on. If you guys want to see more videos and other videos, my friends, let's review the Hunchback of Notre Dame that came out that came out back in 1996. So let's do it. So the Hunchback Notre Dame. Um, so first of all, guys, I you didn't know the Hunchback Notre Dame is based on a and on the 1831 novel by Victor Hugo, and I let me tell you guys, I in my in my opinion, I absolutely love this movie. And the reason why I love this movie because this movie is based on the novel of the Hunger of Notre Dame, and and. And one thing I love about this movie is about acceptance. This is about, about being accepted, basically. Be accepted by this, this society. And it's all about, um, it's all about, um, being, about, about being treated as a person or, or being treated differently. You know what I mean? So that's what happened to Hunter Quasi Moldo here. And in this movie, but yeah. So now guys, let's get into the story of this movie, shall we? So, I, I watched the movie, I watched it last night, watched it all, every day, basically. So I watched it, so let me read this for you. <coughs> Are you guys listening? Great. So it says here, The figures Quasimodo, the bell ringer of the Notre, Notre Dame Cathedral, who remains his time locked away in a tower, with gargoyles, to keep him company, Quasimodo longs to be other, long to be with other people. Mean to be with, with other people, like be with them, right? Uh, leading to his chance, facing Gypsy as murder, when the beautiful young woman grabs the attention of Quasimodo's Quasimodo's protector, Tyrant Rollo. Quasimodo must help to keep Esmeralda, Esmeralda safe from Rollo, Rollo before it's too late. That's right, guys. So basically, guys, in the movie, basically, guys, in the movie, we see uh, Quasimodo who lives in the Notre Dame, like he is, and he lives there for twenty for, for twenty years, and he was kept. By um by Frollo, who is the judge of the of judge of Paris, basically, and and all the years he was on all all the thing, guys. He had the hatred of gypsies, basically, guys. And so in this movie, the gypsies are like the readers and all that kind of stuff, and he don't like them, basically. He wants to find the I think it was the chamber of the miracles of that or. Chambers of Miracles or something like that. I forgot what it's called. Um, but it's called or uh, some of that. Um, so basically, yeah. And um, he actually um want to find find him for years. So, so yeah. So we see Cosmodo uh ring the bells all the kind of time. He's at he's at the top of Notre Dame, and he was um. I mean, he was accompanied by the gargoyles and all the and he won't go to the festival fools but Rollo don't want to go in there, don't want to go there. So so then there was um Phoebus who is the cap new captain of the guard. He was like a kind um captain guard who actually inter actually has to follow Rollo's orders basically. And so it begins. So so Quasimodo actually went into the Festival Falls by sneaking out basically and he was even been there and the old thing he faced a mask 
And you'll say, oh, it's a bell ringing, a bell ringing, it's Christ Modo, basically. And he's like that, and he's like, yes, and he's like, oh my god, basically like that. So, you're like cheering for him, thinking he's the world's power's most obvious, power's most obvious face. But, to me, to me, um, to me, that sounds, um, mean, basically, that, that, that's how mean, basically. So, Fola didn't do anything, Fola just watch him, watch him get tortured, watch him get, watch him get tortured, get, 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 get named that, all the stuff. So, Esmeralda actually helped him, so she, so he went back to Indian Notre Dame, she went to Indian Notre Dame, and she went in there, she was singing all some stuff, and she went to meet Fola's Moldo, he fell in love with her, and, and he actually helped her escape, basically, he escaped out of the, the, the cathedral, of the cathedral. And so, Frollo actually goes back to Notre Dame, after he's been formed by, um, by, by the god, basically. And he actually found out that Quasimo helped her, and he was very happy about it. So he decided to find her, he got to kill it, he, he was killing all these um, people have faint and trying, he was killing the people, but what, that, that's before that. But after that, um, after that, he decided to burn all down Paris, basically, to do it. And, Phoebus actually, um, teamed up with him to find the, um, the Chambers of Miracles. Is it Chamber Miracles? Was it Chamber Miracles he tried to find? What is Chamber Miracles? I forgot what it called. Uh, no. Let me try to find it for you guys. Let me try to find it for you guys. Um. Let me try to find it. Let me try to find it for you guys. Please stick, please bear with me. I sworn it the. Chamber something. That's so fools. Court miracles, that's it. Not chamber miracles. Court miracles, that's it. So they find it and the gypsy thinks that the gypsy thinks that they're spies but they're not. And Bolo actually found them because he followed Quasimodo. They think Quasimodo actually led them to him, led him to them, but he didn't. The old time up took, took, took him away. He tried to build Elfmoldo, but eventually Elfmoldo had got saved by Quasimodo. And there was a massive battle going on. Bolo actually dies, guys. He actually dies. He was on the actual, and um, he was like that. He was like this. And he was on like this, and like a, a tiger looking um, um, pillar or something. Tiger looking pillar. And Tiger actually roared and he went, he breaks, and he goes, ah, about like, like that. And then, Kwanimoto saved the day, he been accepted, and that was awesome. They all sing the bell, he did the bell, so he knows to a dog. I actually loved that, it was really cool. So they take him and held, uh, held him as a hero, so yeah. So guys, that was the story of you know, Hunchman of the Dom. Um, the story was really cool. I actually really enjoyed the story. It was really, really awesome, yeah? So before I go, guys, I'm going to rate this movie out of 10. And I, mean, I got two favorite scenes. My favorite scenes is when Quartz Moto being accepted by the people. With little girl as he hugged him, rubbed his face, and she actually, um, actually dragged him towards the other people, basically. And also... When he saved Elfrelda from that, from the uh, the burning, um, from the bonfire, basically, and yeah, and also guys, this, like I said, this film is based on the 1831 novel by Victor Hugo, and also guys, you know, the, Victor Hugo, they got Victor and Hugo, they were they did the name to the gargoyles, basically, uh, Victor and Hugo, they give his name. To the goggles, that was really, really cool. Yeah, really cool. I really like that. 
So yeah, and also guys, um, oh guys, um, this movie had a sequel named Horseman on Notre Dame 2. So basically, I will do, definitely do that, guys, down the line. I'll do that down the line, yeah? So yeah, so, so guys, that was my review of Horseman Notre Dame. 99 cents movie. Overall, the movie was absolutely cool. I really, 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 really enjoyed it. I really liked this movie. Really loved this movie. It was really cool. And and this movie was most watched. And it's, it wasn't a movie. It represents how people have been, been treated, how being, how to be accepted of, of who you are as a person. Like, if you're this figures or if you're, you're different birth defects or anything, it doesn't like you, you can't be embarrassed or be ashamed what people treat you. You have to they you're special. The one to make you special if you if for who you are. For who you are as a person, that makes you special. Like like to me guys, I actually um uh, I actually got um I was born with a, a with, I was born with a, with a pigeon um, chest basically, and and I didn't get named that but named after anything and and also my teeth here I was I got um, an all bite basically, um all bite out there, and I never get like get named after anything I always get named cold basically, so I asked for accepted as who I am like if if you Feel good about yourself. Just, just be yourself, and just don't, don't let people, guys, guys, don't let people, don't let other people put you down. Don't, don't let them put you down. Don't, don't let you. Don't, don't, don't let them make you feel bad. Just bring, just to prove them, prove them wrong. Prove them that you're a good person. Prove them that, that guy, you are a good person. It's deep side, deep down side of you, you got a good heart. That's the main thing. So because deep down, you're a good person. You're a good, good person. You're a good heart. You're a heart of gold. That's everything only one you got. That, and I mean that, guys. I mean that. And I believe in all of you. I believe you all. Basically, yeah. And also, this movie is about also about bullying. Basically, bullying. I never. Ever accepted bullying? I hate bullying, guys. I get bullied at school, at college. I hate it. I hate bullying. It's it's wrong, and it's not very, very, very nice. I got a thing, guys. Keep your friends close. Keep your enemies closer. And also, if you get bullied, guys, just report it. Report it to just report it to to, pe to the people. Yeah, to to. to to actually special people as it can help you. And if you want school to to tell to, to tell the teacher or tell a teacher or someone who can help you with bullying and stuff. Okay, so basically yeah. And um so yeah. So guys, thank you so much for watching and on Saturday we will be reviewing Chicken Run 2000 movie. That's coming up next. And uh, yeah, and also guys, please let me know if you saw me at Alton Towers um on Monday. So Monday I went to Alton Towers with my family, and it was fun. It was great. It was love hanging out with with my cousins. It was really cool. Loved them so much. Basically, yeah. And um, uh, so so let me know if you saw me. And um, uh, guys, if you see me at Alton Towers again, you know Alton Towers or anything. Please don't be afraid to come up to me. I'm not gonna bite. I'm not. I'm not gonna hurt you or anything. I'm just. I'm a nice guy. I'm a nice guy. I'm just. I, I love to talk to people. I love to interact with people. I love that. Because I'm a very, 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 very friendly person. Basically, I'm. I'm a nice person. So basically, yeah. So yeah. Um. So yeah. No, guys. Let me know what what is your favorite, your favorite ride at Alton Towers. Yeah. But let me let me know. Let me know below. Please, 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 please. Well, that's my favorite. Gangster Granny, that's my favorite. <laughs> so yeah, and also guys, tomorrow I will be doing my teenage Mutant Ninja Turtles movie collection. So that's what I'm doing tomorrow, 
afternoon. I'm doing that tomorrow afternoon. So please do not miss that video. It would be awesome. It would be cool. But yeah. So guys, thanks so much for watching. And I will see you all next time. If you're a new subscriber, please subscribe to the channel. Like the video. And also guys, if you're, re if you're a returning subscriber, welcome back my friend. Please like. And I hope you enjoyed this this video. Hope you enjoy the content. And if, please let me know if you do join the content. Subscribe. No stop. But guys, thanks for watching. I'll see you next time. Take care yourself. Stay awesome. Bye.